Hello, everyone. Thank you so much for taking the time to listen to this presentation today and learn all about what it's like to travel through Alaska by land with rail bookers. I want to introduce myself. I'm Jackie Malecki. I'm really excited to talk to you about these Alaska packages that we have. So a few things we're going to cover today. I'm going to talk about why traveling Alaska by land is becoming the preferred way to really see Alaska. I'll talk about Alaska by rail instead of or in conjunction with the cruise. You can do a rail and sail package or maybe just travel by land and swap it for a cruise this year. I'll talk about the flexibility of traveling by land that Alaska provides you. You can really create your own itinerary that way and kind of travel a little bit more at your own pace. And I'll also go through the onboard accommodations for Alaska Railroad and the different options that you have. Now, for those who are not familiar with Rail Bookers, Rail Bookers is one of our brands. It's a part of the Rail Bookers group. We operate a couple different brands. Rail Bookers is worldwide independent rail travel. So today, really just narrowing down, focusing on Alaska, but we have packages all throughout Europe. If you want to travel to Italy, Spain, Switzerland, and take a train to the Swiss Alps, we can do all of that for you. We also operate Amtrak Vacations. We're the official tour operator for Amtrak. So anywhere in the U.S. that you're looking to travel, if a train goes there, so do we. We have some amazing packages to some great national parks like Grand Canyon, Glacier National Park. So no matter where you're interested in traveling to, it's likely we have packages for you. So definitely check out our other brands. Now, if you're looking to travel to Alaska, we can book anywhere from today to two years from now. And that actually applies beyond Alaska. That's really for any of our packages. So if you're looking for a last minute getaway somewhere, we can help you with that. If you want to plan ahead, you want something to look forward to, we can book up to two years out. And I mentioned with rail bookers, we have packages all throughout the world. And we have direct partnerships with all the different train companies. So that's what makes booking with rail bookers really easy and great is that we have exclusive access to a lot of these train companies. So some of them you can't book till you know 30 days in advance. We can book, like I said, up to two years in advance. And it can also be very complicated if you're trying to book a multi-trip multi-train journey uh, working with all these different companies, but give us a call, one call, we can take care of all of it for you. And that's really why our travelers love working with us here at Rail Bookers, because no rail trip is too complicated for us. We can put these all together. What may seem really confusing, our team can easily put together. They can also give great advice on the best rail routes to take, uh, and they can help customize anything for you. So there's lots of flexibility when booking with us. So what does Rail Bookers offer? What do our packages include? Of course, the train component of it. So we do the confirmed seat reservations. We take care of all that for you. We can let you know about the different upgrades that are available and the differences between the train accommodations. We add in the sightseeing activities for you in the different places that you're visiting. We're booking your hotels. We can take care of ferries. Uh, so maybe you're in Vancouver and you want to spend some time there, take a ferry out to Victoria for a day trip. We can book that for you. Excursions, if you want to get out of the city a little bit. And we can also do overnight rail journeys. That's always a really cool, unique experience to actually be able to sleep on the train. And while I go through some of the packages that I have in just a minute, I want you to keep a couple things in mind. I really want to emphasize that you can customize any of these packages. This is really to give you an idea. So if you want to add on an additional destination, 
you can do that if you want to make it round trip. You know, a couple of them I talk about will be round trip, but maybe I have one that is not, but you would like to add an additional trainer. No problem. You can do that. We can do any of these packages in reverse, so especially if you're trying to line it up with the cruise. Maybe I said it starts in Anchorage, ends in Fairbanks, but you want to start in Fairbanks and end in the reverse to then hop on your train. No problem. We can do that for you. Uh, I mentioned we have all different kinds of upgrades available. If you want to go to first class on the train, we can even add more tours, upgrade you to private tours on some of these trips here. If you're wondering what hotels we stay at or what hotels you can use, it's really a range. We have three, four, five star hotels. You can also mix and match. Maybe you want to start off your trip in a little bit of luxury. You want a five star hotel. It's a really iconic hotel. You can do that. And then maybe for the others, you do three, four star to try to keep the package, you know, within your budget. So tons of flexibility is really what I'm getting at here that we really want to make these packages special and unique to you. So let us know what you're looking for. We can certainly provide some suggestions to on the best options. So with that, that's just kind of a little bit who we are. Uh, now I want to dive in and talk about some of the great packages that we have to Alaska. I'm going to start off with our Arctic Circle and Denali National Park with Alaska Railroad. It starts off in Fairbanks, which has been referred to as the gateway to the far north, referring to the Arctic Circle. So from Fairbanks, we include a full day tour that will take you to the Arctic Circle. And on that trip, you can learn about the transatlantic pipeline. You'll see the Yukon River, possibly even spot some Alaskan wildlife. And you're actually going to travel along the famous Dalton Highway. Some of you may be thinking, that sounds really familiar. It became very well known from the TV show Ice Road Truckers. It's the road that goes up to the Arctic Circle. So after exploring there, you're going to hop on board the Alaska Railroad train, and you're going to take that down to Denali National Park, where you can spend two nights exploring. Denali National Park and Preserve encompasses six million acres of Alaska's rugged interior wilderness. So massive national park. And the centerpiece of it all is the 20,310 feet high Denali Mountain. So Mount McKinley, as it was formerly known as. It's actually the tallest peak in North America. In Denali, we do include a half day sightseeing tour for you, taking you into the park. So you'll see some incredible scenery, uh, and definitely lots of opportunities to see some wildlife. And then after exploring Denali, you'll take the train down to Anchorage for your final night stay. We do include a guided trolley tour there that will take you all around Anchorage, including Lake Hood, which is the busiest seaplane base. You can actually see them taking off and landing on the water. And we have a lot of different hotel options. If you want to be right by the water, we have the beautiful lakefront anchorage. Amazing views from there. You can see the planes, which I just find really cool, um, especially if they're taking off everything. It's, it's really unique and different. But we do have options right by the train station as well, such as the uh, hill and anchorage. So if you want to just walk across the street, you can get right to your hotel there. So lots of options. For you. And that is our Arctic Circle and Denali National Park with Alaska Railroad seven day adventure. Now, the packages I'm talking about today with Denali, they are seasonal as the park and the hotels in Denali are only open during the summer months. So, space is selling out quickly with high demand and just a limited season. We also have our Grand Alaska Adventure with Alaska Railroad Southbound. On this one here, you can enjoy all the best places that Alaska has to offer on a 10-day journey. Alaska is famous for its 
glaciers, fjords, mountains, and lakes. And on this trip, you will be able to see it all. This is the southbound version, so it's beginning in Fairbanks, but again, we can do it in either direction. Here, you're gonna travel the full length of the Denali Star train route. So you'll start off in Fairbanks. You do have some free time to explore there. If you're traveling in the beginning or later in the season, definitely late at night, you may have opportunities to see the Northern Lights. Then you're going to travel on Alaska Railroad. And again, this route from Fairbanks down to Denali, it's called the Denali Star. Absolutely amazing, beautiful scenery. Uh, if you do accommodations at Gold Star, they actually have an outdoor viewing platform. So that's where this couple is enjoying all of the views there, getting some great pictures on the train. Then in Denali, You'll be able to explore the park on your included half day tour. And you do have free time after two, so you can get out, explore some of the trails that'll leave right from the visitor center in the park and kind of have your own exploration, your own mini hike. All of the hotels that we work with in Denali, they include transportation to get you around. So you don't need to worry about renting a car or anything like that. They'll pick you right up from the train station, bring you to the hotel. The tour will pick you up from your hotel and the hotel provides shuttles that run frequently, whether it's to the visitor center where all the trails are so you can get out and explore Denali. It can take you right to the park. There's also a town that has some different restaurants, little shops. There's other tours, adventures that kind of leave from there. Um, so the transfers will also take you down there. So again, very easy to get around Denali National Park. Then from there, you're gonna travel south to Talkeetna. It's a charming small town, very walkable, very cool little town. And it's home to the convergence of three major glacial rivers. So it makes it really great for excursions and also really great just to walk the banks of some of the rivers there and take in the amazing views of the town. Then after Talkeetna, continue on to Anchorage. You're gonna spend a night there before hopping on the coastal classic train. That's the one that runs from Anchorage to Seward. It's actually one of National Geographic Traveler's top train rides in America. So on that train, you'll get some really spectacular views from the dramatic coastline of Turnigan Arm, and you'll pass by several backcountry glaciers, which can all be seen right from your seat on the train. Then when you're in Seward, we do include a cruise around Kenai Fjords National Park. So you can see all the remote islands, the wildlife most commonly spotted are sea lions and seals. You may even see whales, depending when you're there, but you'll definitely see the tidewater glaciers. And that is our Grand Alaska Adventure with Alaska Railroad, the southbound version. So lots to do and see on this 10 day journey. Now, if you're looking for something a little shorter, maybe a little less time for your vacation, here's another great option. It's our Alaska Adventure with Alaska Railroad. This one here is round trip from Anchorage. You're gonna start off exploring the city with the Anchorage trolley tour. You can see the trolley right here. It's a one hour, 15 mile guided tour. And some of the highlights that you'll see along the way are Earthquake Park, which actually back in the 60s, there was a 9.2 earthquake on the Richter scale and a whole neighborhood actually slid into the ocean. So that park is there to commemorate that. It'll also take you to Westchester Lagoon, which is where wildlife is commonly spotted. You'll see the float plains departing from Lake Hood and lots more. After exploring Anchorage, you're going to travel on that famous coastal classic train that I mentioned from Anchorage to Seward. Now, all of our packages come standard in Adventure Class, which you can see pictured right here. Uh, you can also see it's pretty comfortable, lots of legroom, lots of space there. 
there's big windows to take in all the views. You're not confined to your seat the whole time. You can get up, you can walk around, you know, between adventure class cars. There's also a cafe car where you can purchase, you know, snacks, meals, drinks. They have a bar on board. And above that car is the Vista Dome car. So you can also go up there, all glass windows, and take in some of the great views along your journey. And then when you're in Seward, we'll take you on the cruise around Resurrection Bay, Kenai Fjords. You do have some free time as you'll be spending an overnight here in Seward. Uh, we usually have you staying at the beautiful Windsong Lodge, which is really close to Exit Glacier. You can see that picture here. So during your free time, you can definitely explore Exit Glacier, or maybe you just want to check out the town of Seward with some of the local shops and different restaurants there. Then you'll take the train back to Anchorage. On the train, there's two different types of accommodations. So I mentioned adventure. There's also the option to upgrade to Gold Star service, which you can see here. In Gold Star, where the seats are, it is a dome car already. So you have the glass ceilings all around you. This is actually the upper level of the train because below this is where the restaurant is. And all the meals are included for those in Gold Star service. So you can relax up here in the afternoon. When lunch is ready, you'll go right downstairs. Uh, you can order off the menu. There's also a bartender there. So you can see people getting drinks right there. There's two drinks included per person every time you're on the train. So you can relax, enjoy those, take in the great views passing along the water. There's the outdoor viewing platform. So on a beautiful day, you can step out there. So really fantastic upgrade. I highly recommend doing at least one segment of it in Gold Star service. All right, so then after you're in Anchorage, you're gonna spend the overnight there. Anchorage is really to connect some of these train routes. Then you're can going to continue to Talkeetna, where we have you staying at the Talkeetna Alaska Lodge. And as I mentioned before, Talkeetna is where all the rivers meet. So we do have jet boat tours as well that can actually take you on the rivers. And there's a great spot where they stop and you can see Denali in the mountain, uh, especially on a clear day. Absolutely gorgeous to see that towering over. Then after Talkeetna, you'll head over to Denali, which is really the crown jewel of Alaska. And a little insider tip that I'll give you, when visiting Alaska, bring binoculars because it'll help you see all the wildlife. Sometimes, and they usually are close to the uh, roads and the tour buses, so you do have great views of them already if you don't bring them. But if you have binoculars, often you can see additional wildlife up in the mountains, the hills and things. So when I was there, we saw a mama bear and her cubs, but it was up high kind of in the mountains a little bit. So you could just see it with the bear eye, um, but those with binoculars could get an amazing view and really see them up close. So just a little tip, definitely bring those. Trust me, it is well worth it. And it'll help you on the train as well. And then after exploring Denali, you'll hop on the train back down to Anchorage for final night, then you can catch a flight the next day. So again, this one here, round trip from Anchorage, makes it really easy for booking round trip flights. And the last one I wanna talk about is our Denali National Park with Alaska Railroad northbound. This one has been very popular as a post-cruise package. So if you are doing a cruise through Alaska and you're ending in Seward or Whittier, then you want to explore Alaska by land, you wanna take the train after, here's a great one for you. Let us know if you're doing that because the train does run from Seward and Whittier. So we can add the train from there to take you right to Anchorage to begin this package. A lot of the cruises also offer transfers to Anchorage as well. So you do have those options. So with this package here, you're gonna start off in Anchorage. You're gonna explore there before heading over to Talkeetna. And if you want a once in a lifetime experience, 
I highly recommend adding on a flight seeing tour in Talkeetna. You'll get a bird's eye view of the mountains, glaciers, the rivers. You'll be able to see Denali up close. You'll go above the clouds there. And that's where you can really see how massive it truly is. And you even have the option to land right on a glacier. So when you look around, the only thing around you is the mountains, the glacier, the snow. You can get out of the plane, walk around. It's just the most unique experience you can ever have. So highly recommend adding that on. Definitely give us a call and ask one of our vacation consultants about that experience. Then from Talkeetna, you're going to continue up to Denali. We have a couple different hotel options. One of the ones is the Denali cabins. You can see pictured here. They're situated in a quiet wooded setting. So you get the true Alaska wilderness feel while still having all the amenities and comfort of a full resort uh, hotel. They do have you know, full service dining, a restaurant there that's open for all meals. At night after exploring, you can go to the fire pits to relax. Definitely an ideal base camp for exploring Denali National Park. And they do have the shuttle to take you to these cabins here and to the property, um, back to the park, to the train station, everything. So again, very easy to get around Denali. We do have a couple other options. Um, so if you're looking to stay at the Grand Denali Lodge, Denali Bluffs, which are both in town, we can certainly do that for you too. And then after exploring Denali, you'll head up to Fairbanks. When you're in Fairbanks, we do include some free time for you to explore on your own as well. There's lots of different adventures to be had. Fairbanks is kind of a great home base uh, for getting out and exploring and one that I recommend is if you're looking to relax at the end of your vacation, do the chain of hot springs. You can go out, just sit back, relax, kind of enjoy that. It's really the perfect way to end your vacation. And that is our Denali National Park and Alaska Railroad northbound package. We do have a southbound version as well which can be done if you want to do a pre-cruise option. Or this can also be done as a standalone trip because you really get to see all the best of Alaska on this journey here. Now, that was just a small sample of our Alaska packages and what we have. So definitely check us out online, railbookers.com. Give us a call if you're ready to book or if you have more questions or you can book with your local travel agent. We do have our brochures available to download on our website so you can really check out everything that we have. But I do want to say thank you so much, everyone, for joining me, for listening to this today. I hope you learned a lot about what it's like to travel through Alaska. And if you need anything, give us a call. We are here for you. Thank you so much. Have a wonderful day.